There's no stars, there's no sun, no time off for anyone. There's no clock on the wall, there's no end to it all. Everyone's on overtime, and there's no overtime. Oh, your book life is weighed on a good bad divider. Oh, there's much too much to grade for a cynical decider. Four things changed in my office since the last episode. Let's see if you can spot them all. Look, all I'm saying is I just don't think you're heaven material. What do you mean? I was the best Viking to ever exist. Yeah, well, being the best Viking doesn't exactly amount to you being a good person. They like good people up there. Not a good person, but I was well known across the land. They even sang songs about me. Oh, yeah, you were definitely... Harold the heinous, nobody is insane as Harold the heinous. That's why he's famous. He'll pillage your village, he'll rape your... No, 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 that's enough, that's enough. Well, I was going to say anus. Yeah, yeah, I figured. Listen, Harold... I was the best at it. Right, that's my point. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and send you where people who are the best at that sort of thing go, okay? Bye. Bye. <laughs> Woo, go, Tony! You're the best, Tony. Oh, what? That's weird. <laughs> hey, fuck you, Tony! Yeah, that sounds normal. Well done on the verdict there, Tony. Yeah, it looks like I did a great job on that one. Lots of cheering. It's kind of strange, actually. Great work, Tony. Oh, thanks. Uh, I don't know who you are. I'm Demonessa, and you're cute. Especially when you send people to hell. Okay. <laughs> That was weird, but also sort of hot. You think she likes me? Perhaps. Demons are sexually liberated creatures, open to all manner and configuration of partners. Be careful, Tony. She's a succubus. Well, she suck my what? No, Tony. She feeds off sexual energy from her host lover, leaving them an empty husk of unrequited sexual frustration. Though, if I had an ex-wife, this would be a pretty good time to say something like, oh, just like my ex-wife, but... But you've always been alone. Yeah, always alone. Hey, Tony. Feeling heavenly today? You gonna send lots of people to heaven? No way. Tony's gonna send people to hell. All those bad people, right, Tony? <laughs> you guys are just gonna have to wait and see. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. Nobody's ever paid this much attention to me. <laughs> this is kind of nice. Well, you should have sent that Viking to heaven, you stupid shit. Uh... He was a beautiful soul. Oh, hey. Whoa. Do I know you? Tread lightly, you fucking ball bag. Damien has his eyes on you. Oh! Hey, Max, uh, do you know why that angel, Damien, was so pissed off at me? You cost him quite a lot of winnings, Tony. Oh, uh, winnings? You don't know? Oh my, Tony, there's something of a betting pool going on surrounding your clients. Well, what do you mean? At first, it was just a little distraction from the eons of door drums and boredom, but then it became one of the only activities that people in the office actually look forward to. So you guys bet on where caseworkers send souls? Just where you send them, Tony. You have a reputation for being unpredictable. You send people places seemingly at random. It's like you don't even get to know them. I, I've, I've been trying. Hey, Tony. How's it going, buddy? I'm heading to the kitchen. You need anything? Refill your coffee? Back rub? You good on paper clips, buddy? You want me to suck that dick? What about staples? You good there? Oh, I'm good, guys. Thanks. Thanks a lot. How are you feeling today? Are you feeling like it's a hell day or a heaven day or... Oh, hey, I'm feeling like how can there be any kind of day if time here is irrelevant and meaningless? Am I right, guys? <laughs> <laughs> See, Tony? Everyone is quite invested in your moods now. They are trying to read you like a short, frumpy barometer. Oh, that's weird. And manipulate you for their own gain, like assholes. Hey, Death, I got a real problem. Uh, yeah, me too. I've got a wicked hangover. Make this quick, Tony. Oh, okay, well, see, people have been betting on where I send souls. Yeah, so fucking what? O okay, what are they betting because you don't pay us anything? I don't know. Tickets, probably? Tickets? Yeah, tickets for the prize table. There's a prize table? Ah, Tony, inside voices, please. God, have you ever read your employee handbook? Screw it. Here's another one. This one's got pictures in it. I truly believe you can read it if you try. Uh, how do you get tickets? I I've never gotten any tickets. Oh, you can get them lots of ways, Tony. Good performance reviews from your managers. Never got one of those. Gambling. Yeah. The skee ball machine. There's a skee ball machine? Ah, Tony, volume. Yes, read your handbook. I could have been playing skee ball instead of spending my breaks crying under my desk. Well, you certainly have the high score for crying under your desk, Tony. Can't get tickets for that, though. Oh, I don't even care about the tickets! They're betting on me, Death! Like I'm a mud wrestler or a dog being ridden by a midget! It's degrading! Hey, hey, we say little person, Tony. 
Also, you were okay with it until you realized they were using you? Well, yeah, that's how exploitation works. So just pretend you didn't learn the second part. That's not so bad, right? Ignorance is bliss. So you're totally okay with this? Ah, uh, Tony, when you burst into my office, I try to read you. Like, well, like a short, fat, stupid, bald thermometer. No. If you seem hot, I try to cool you down. If you seem cold, I try to keep you there. Not because I care, because I want you to get the fuck out of my office as quickly as possible. Oh, okay, why does everyone think I'm weather equipment? Today, Tony, the reading I'm getting from you says, mm, tell them not to fight. If people are being nice to you for whatever reason, enjoy it. Take it. I, I guess that's not so bad. I mean, this sort of makes a lot of sense, Death. It is sort of nice to have people paying attention to me. I haven't been this popular since I was covered in old bread and I met all those pigeons. <laughs> what are you doing, Tony? Are you going to fart? Do not fart in my office. Oh, I was trying to do a flashback, but I can't. Never mind. I'll just go away now. Sorry for bothering you. Hey, Tony. What? Why don't you have a ticket and hit the prize table? On me. What are you going to get from the prize table? I'm shooting for the sweet keytar. If that noise, I'm all about the game station. 100,000 tickets, baby. Think I could borrow some of your tickets to get myself some plastic spiders? Oh. Well, if ignorance is bliss. Here you son of a bitch. You keep losing me tickets by sending souls to the wrong afterlife, and it's gonna fucking stop. Are you listening? So uh, what are you gonna do? Kill me? We're already dead. Ow! What the hell? Hurts, doesn't it? Now imagine I'm punching your arm, but instead of my fist, it's this knife, and instead of your arm, it's your eyes. So here's what you're gonna do. The next client that comes to your desk, you're gonna send them to heaven. I'm betting everything on heaven. B -b 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 send them to heaven, or you're taking the knife train straight to I Town, you fucking dick. Oh jeez, oh fuck. Oh man, I'm in too deep. Oh shit, come on, please be a good one. I gotta send somebody to heaven or that guy's gonna fuck my eyes out with a knife. <laughs> oh, thank God, it's a little tiny baby. Hello, tiny baby. Hello. Oh, that's a weird way for a tiny baby to talk, Mr. Tiny Baby. Uh, okay, well, I'm Tony, this is Purgatory, and you're dead. And you will be determining the fate of my immortal soul? Actually, yes. Uh, but don't worry, little baby. You're just a little baby, so little babies pretty much always go to, uh... Hell! Why? Send me to hell, Tony. That is where heathens go, isn't it? What do you mean, little baby? I could never be welcomed into the open bosom of heaven, for you see, Tony... Tony, I was never baptized. Thousand tickets on hell! I don't know, little baby. There's a picture of you here at your christening. They didn't baptize you? I'm Catholic. We sprinkle, Tony. I was never sprinkled. I was submerged. Submerged? Oh, dunked like a Baptist. Two thousand on heaven! You'd be shocked at how little that actually matters, baby. No one even checks. That in the foreskin. No one cares, it turns out. I was far more than dunked, Tony. I was drowned in the abysmal baptismal. Oh, that's the saddest thing I've ever heard, tiny baby. Okay, we gotta get you to heaven. Oh, crap, this is bad. Make that three thousand on heaven! But wait. Well, what now? There is more, Tony. Tony, for you see, I'm hecka gay. 4,000 tickets on hell! Well, I mean, that's not actually a problem, but, but, but how do you even know? I know. Oh, I totally know. Look, don't be so hard on yourself, baby. Just just listen, you need to... Uh... I killed my mother during childbirth. I'm a murderer. Oh, sure, they said it was medical complications, but for robbing the world of her sweet, shining light, I deserve eternal damnation. Flames for me, Tony. Flames. You're being very dramatic, baby. Well, I'm very gay. Send that baby to heaven. Tony, sweetie, send him to hell. We never get babies in hell, and we just go nuts over them. They're like little kittens that talk and poop their pants. Yeah, yeah, but the other guy with the eye knives. Five thousand for heaven! If you send him to hell, maybe I'll give you seven minutes in heaven. Oh, I'd like that. You go fuck her! Ten thousand on hell! I'ma slice up your eyeballs, you little bitch! No, oh, but I gotta do the right thing, too! Heaven! All in! Oh, everybody, shut up! I have to think about this! Oh, okay, stay here, baby. Oh, oh, man. Hey, Death. Ah, Tony, damn it. Close the door. It's too bright. Oh, okay. Ah, don't slam it. Fuck. 
It's an elevator. Yeah. Hey, man, the stakes out there are too high. Personal stakes, too. I think I might either get murdered or laid, depending on how I play this. Tony, I want to show you a presentation. Can you see okay, Tony? Uh, yeah, I can. Okay, Tony. This presentation is about how much of a shit I give about what happens to you in this office. Ugh. Okay, slide one. See that? It's blank. Now here's slide two. Uh, I'm sensing a pattern here. Okay now, Tony, here's slide 48. Uh-huh, yeah, I get it. This is gratuitous. Okay, I'll just go. I, I just wanted some advice. Tony, I've already given you all the advice you need. Now fuck off. Well, Tony, what's your call? My afterlife must be decided. I trust you'll do what's right and send me to hell. Listen to that baby, Tony! Don't listen to him! He's too young to consent! He can't make his own decisions, man! Send him to hell, Tony. Hell is so hot right now. Send him to heaven or I'll fucking slice you. Okay, I've made my decision, baby. Have to carefully review in your file. Heaven! Hell! All in! I've decided to send you... All in on heaven! A hundred thousand on hell! I'll match that! To Earth to have a second chance in life! <gasps> what the fuck did he say? Can you do that? According to the employee handbook, page 1,382, paragraph 4, a newborn soul extinguished before making a single conscious decision may not be held accountable to standard judgment. It says I can send him back to Earth! Ha! You all thought I wouldn't read it! That's right, you manipulative jerks! I read the handbook! I read all of it! God damn it! I'm ruined! My tickets! Tony, you motherfucker! I hate you so much! Wait, everyone, hold on. Someone did bet on Earth. They bet one single ticket on Earth at a million to one odds. It was... Say it! Say who it was! Tony Purgatelli! <laughs> That's right, you crap bags! A million tickets for Tony! You tried to use me, but I turned it on you, didn't I? How's that for unpredictable? I'm gonna fucking kill you, Tony! In the eye! Fuck you, Tony! Fuck you! Oh, whatever will I buy with my one million tickets? Mm. My guitar. Oh, you wanted this? You wanted this right here? Oh, no, come on, Tony, not the game station. <laughs> I'll tell you what, just go ahead and give me everything, all of it, all the prizes! Hey Tony, what about me? I'm actually your real friend. Oh yeah, and for Max, <laughs> what do you want? Like a wacky wall walker, a pencil topper? Oh, get the Velcro dartboard, those are cool! I want to cover my body in plastic spiders. Oh, and a Chinese finger trap. <laughs> Tony wins! Tony oh, God, wins! Tony wins! <laughs> I, uh, I probably can't ask anybody for help, right? Max? Max, are you there? I I'm stuck! I don't want any help, Tony. I'm so content. Oh, is that on your... Oh! Look in my eyes, Tony. We're sharing a moment. Ugh. Hey, Death! What is it, Tony? That was a pretty good episode, right? I liked it. That was fine. I liked the part where the big skeleton said stuff. He was great. No. What's his name? Yeah, Death. Oh, he's great. He's the best character. That's what everybody says. You know who the worst character is? No. Guess who it is, Tony? Chad Bradley. Nope. Oh, God, I want to know. Just click on the next episode.